So hi, everybody. I'm Dusty. I'm one of the co-founders of uh, Laughter at Chapel, which was created in Melbourne, Australia. We've done laughter there for a year. And also I was a co-founder of um, Laughter at Bangkok. We had the Bangkok Love and Laughter Club, which we ran for eight years. Wow. So yeah, it, it's, it was wow. great. It was amazing. And we still have aspects bonk, of that bonk. going. Lecky, who's here today, she helps continue on, not so much as a club, but when people contact, she does laughter for them too. So I've been doing laughter for about 15 years and you've all been doing laughter, so I don't need to explain the benefits. Um, Marty, you're a laugher, is that correct? Yes, yes, I've been, yeah, about 15 years. Okay, fantastic. So you're a pro. So today, what I wanted to offer is just something different, a different aspect to our practices, which I hope will be helpful. And I hope it's a blessing to you. And so I'm just going to share my screen. Okay. Hi, so if everyone could mute their, um, here we go, there we go. Okay, so welcome to body awareness through mindful, mirthful movement. So today's practice is, like I said, it's going to be a bit different. I want to get us back into our bodies. Quite often we use laughter to stop thinking so much and activate creativity. So today I want to get us back and thinking mindfully about our bodies. So have you been busier than ever since the pandemic restrictions have eased, felt out of sync with your body rhythms and needs? I've heard this a lot from people. Do you desire a boost of better holistic being, even as laughter practitioners? Maybe especially as laughter practitioners. Or simply want to feel more at home in your own skin? Then this session is for you. Today we invite you to help co-create a return to beautiful body being. Beautiful body being through mindful mirthful movement. This guided set of restorative laughter exercises are easily accessible to all levels of ability and promise to have you singing in no time, every little cell in my body is happy. So usually, as you know, we all share the laughter exercises and I have everyone help co-create. But today, I'm doing this to, I will lead most of it. And if there's time, we'll have everybody also share. But I want to do this more as a gift. So I'm, with your permission, I'd like to guide you today. And you can just relax and enjoy. So why this? Sorry, sorry.
Lekki, you'll know New Life Foundation from Plum Village in Thailand. So I'm going to invite everybody just to take a minute. And as you know, I usually have us all check in with our body, our physically, mentally, emotionally, spiritually. I look at our beings as four bodies of energy, a house with four rooms. And if we live in one room too much, it's not good, or we neglect other rooms, it's not good for our wholeness, our well-being. But today I want to concentrate on us physically, our bodies. So I invite everyone to please just check in for a moment with your body. How does it feel? I invite you to look beyond the basics that might say, I'm tired, hot, hungry, happy, sleepy, energetic. Look beyond that. And think of, you might want to close your eyes if you're comfortable to do so. Think of where do you hold tension, grief, sadness, anger, fear. Where does it feel good, light, joyful, relaxed? What? sensations are there what words from this list that you can see on the screen fit how you feel right now you don't need to share these but just keep this in mind Once you have an idea of how you're feeling, what's going on, where you hold these emotions in different parts of your body. For me, when I'm tense, I clench my jaw and my shoulders and my back gets very tense and I get headaches. And I quite often carry grief in my chest, in my heart and in my stomach. So we all have different ways of carrying this and our body has, it remembers. It remembers trauma, it remembers stress, it remembers difficulties. So I figure why can't it remember joy too? Anyway, I've learned a very big lesson in my life of to really listen to my body's whispers before they become screams because I've ended up with injuries from not listening and continually continuing to do the same things over and over. But once you have that awareness, you can do something about it. So have you said thank you to your body today for doing such a great job? I mean, it's the reason we're here. It's how we're here. This is our vehicle, right? It's helped us to show up. Why not? Often we pay attention to our body when something goes wrong with it, such as a sickness or pain, an accident, or people around us are unwell. Our bodies pay attention to how we treat it too. Our beliefs such as I'm slow, stupid, fat, ugly, clumsy, old, wrinkled, etc., may affect our perceptions and quality of life as well as our well-being. I believe our body hears us. I used to see people do this in Thailand all the time. Oh, help me. I'm so old. And I go, how old are you? And they were like five years younger than me. And I thought, why would you say that about yourself all the time? I love aging. Don't get me wrong. I, I'm all for maturing. There's nothing wrong with aging, but it's how you talk about it and think about it that matters. So there's so many ways to thank our body. We can talk to it compassionately and move it and shake it and do breath work and grounding exercises. We can sing and dance. We can help it feel good with proper sleep, nourishing food and water. And we can play love and laugh to enjoy and bring out the best in it. I invite you to celebrate and recover your beautiful body being through today's mindful, mirthful movement practice. Let's have a little thank you party to our amazing bodies. 
Okay, so if you are able and you feel comfortable, please stand up. We're going to do some movement exercises. If you're in the car, don't do that. <laughs> I love your screen, Melissa, it's great. <laughs> so, and just, we're all inclusive. So you just do what you can do in the way that you're comfortable. Chris is actually lying down. He's got a fever, he's quite sick. So I'm hoping that our love and our laughter and our positive energy will kindly, gently wash over him and be healing. So just do whatever you can in the way you can. We're going to do a little bit of Tai Chi. So with Tai Chi, I'm going to move my screen a bit. With Tai Chi, we want our arms, we want our knees, our feet. Let's start at our feet. Our feet, hip distance apart. We're going to bend our knees gently and our arms hang at our side, but they don't touch our legs. They're about four to six inches away from our body. This is so that we can have energy flow. Take a breath and just release it through a sigh. <sighs> when you sigh, let your tongue relax to the bottom of your mouth and your jaw open a little bit. In through the nose. <sighs> Thank your body for showing up and being here today and being willing to work with you towards better health. Okay, let's start with our hands. Let's rub our hands really vigorously. Palm to palm, we want to really rub our palms and our fingers all the way to our fingertips. Can you feel them warming up? Can you feel the warmth coming from your palms? Really rub those palms. Can you move, feel it moving to your fingertips? Three more rubs. One, two, three. Put your hands by your side again. Close your eyes if you feel comfortable. Can you feel energy, warmth, tingling? Maybe you can feel your pulse even. Next step is move your hands back, bring them together, and now start rubbing that warmth into the back of your hands. Oh, a nice hand massage slowly gently firmly feel it really feel your hands feel your skin moving feel inside your hands in between your fingers oh and all the way to your wrists our wrists often get so sore from typing nice warm healing love we're putting back into our bodies. Release your hands down to your sides again. Close your eyes if you feel comfortable. How do your hands and wrists feel now? This time now we're going to take our hands up to our heart like this, and we're just going to release them. Let your muscles and your joints and your ligaments relax as you release them. Three more, one, two, three, to your side. How do they feel now? Has this opened up space in your hands and your arms? Is there warmth, is there tingling? What sensations are you feeling?
Now we're going to lift our shoulders and drop them. Three more times. One, two, three. How does it feel from your neck and your shoulders down to your fingertips? Now let's move all that energy into our whole bodies. This time, keep your knees soft still, hands to your side. We're just gonna bounce and jiggle. We're going to shake just up and down. Both feet are flat on the ground. We're connecting to the earth. And everything's loose and relaxed and releasing. And put a smile on your face. See how that feels. Does that change the movement? Imagine yourself a beautiful container full of precious liquid gold. And every time you shake up and down, you're moving it around in your body. The energy is just going around your body. <sighs> Fantastic. Now take your arms side to side. Let's move that around. <sighs> Can you feel your spine? your hips, your legs, your feet on the ground, your hands moving, the smile on your face. <sighs> Wonderful breathing. Maybe your heart's beating a bit. <sighs> Slow down, come back to a relaxed position. What do you feel now? <sighs> okay, now we're going to take our hands and when we open them up, our palms are up. So what we're doing is we're, we're crouched a little bit. So we're squatting a little bit, just not greatly, but just a little bit with knees relaxed. And as we come up, we lift and straighten and we look up and then we release. And we breathe out as we release. So breathe in. <sighs> Last one. Fantastic. Circle your hands around. Put your left hand on your belly and your right hand on top of it. We're going to do some thoracic breathing. So we're going to breathe in both our chest and our stomach, but we're going to start with our belly. So this is belly breathing. And we're going to breathe in very slowly and gently through our nose, but we're going to fill our stomachs till they expand. And we don't want our chest to expand. So let's create space in there. Bye, Melissa. Enjoy. Thank you. Bye. And don't try and push the air out. Just release it when it's on. We're in no hurry to get anywhere. We're right here. 
right now. This last breath, release it with a loud sigh. Push all the air out. Ah. And give me a big smile. Come back to standing. Gently put your hands by your side and just note how you feel. Do you feel brighter, lighter, opened up, more space within? Look inside for a moment. Very good. Very good. Yay. Give yourself a gentle clap. Pat yourself on the back. Give yourself a hug and breathe into your chest now so that your arms expand. Only your chest, not your belly. Hands to the side of your ribs. Breathe into the side. Release your arms and breathe into your upper back. Fantastic. Okay, so now... We're going to start, but the, as I said, it's going to be a gentle return to ourselves. So let's do some humming for warm up. Put your hands on your chest gently. And we're going to hum. So what we're going to do is we're going to breathe in, breathe out, tongue to the bottom of your mouth, breathe in, and then when you breathe in, hum for a long time, as long as you can, until you're ready, and then do the breathe in, breathe out, breathe in again, okay? Mm. Last one. Mm. You should be feeling this in your ears and your nose and your sinus and your chest and your throat. Very good. Very good. Yay. So in our club, we go very good to everyone that's here and very good to our souls for showing up and we celebrate that unity. Yay, fantastic. Would you all mind to put your, unmute yourself, please. So for this one, this is let's get into our luscious, lovely lips. <laughs> and this is the best way to warm your vocal cords and not damage your voice, but actually really help it because we really use vocals a lot in laughter. So we're going to blow raspberries. Put your hands on your hips. Do a little wriggle. And then blow a raspberry. Sometimes I have people who can't do it and just it's so hilarious. All right. 
Very good. Very good. Very good. Yay. Yay. Laughter. Now that we're back in our bodies with a bit more awareness, let's put laughter into the last Tai Chi move. So what we're going to do is gently squat a little bit, hands to the side again. We're going to open them up. We're going to gather all this love and this joy and this health and this healing. I'm going to look up, bend back a bit, just a slight bit. You'll probably feel that all the way down your stomach. And then we're going to breathe in. Feel the pressure and just laugh. <laughs> <laughs> all that love, all that love, gather it up, hold it up to the sky. Oh, it's so beautiful. It's getting heavy. Breathe it. <laughs> One more. Look up all that love, laughter, joy, good health, wonderful, beautiful blue sky. Breathe it in. Ah, you so full and so much you can't hold it any longer. <laughs> Very good. Very good. Very good. Yay. 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 Uh, hello. Welcome. Ho. Now, if we're in our bodies properly, what are we feeling? We're feeling our hands. Are they sticky? Are we perspiring a bit? When we say ho, ho, where are we feeling it in our bodies? So this time, don't concentrate so much because you will know ho, ho, ha, ha, ha. You can do it in your sleep. You probably do. But this time I want you to really concentrate on your body as you're doing it, as if you're chanting ho, ho, ha, ha, ha over your body. Ho, ho, ha, ha, ha. 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 Do you feel it in your legs? Ho, ho, ha, ha, ha. Ho, ho, ha, ha, ha. Ho, ho, ha, ha, ha. Oh, oh. <laughs> now let's let's give it to each other's bodies. Ho ho ha 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 Imagine everybody's giving it to us now and we're receiving it. It's that bouncing feeling again. Remember the bouncing feel? <laughs> Remember all that golden liquid oil that's running around our bodies? Now it's filling up with laughter. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Very good. Very good. Very good. Yay. Yay. Okay. So now I want you to think as yourself as an elevator. All this golden liquid laughter that we've put into ourselves and each other. I want you to laugh through your nose, then through your mouth, through your throat, through your chest, and then down into your belly. See if you can just laugh. And it doesn't have to get louder. We're not doing gradient laughter yet. We will in a minute. So let's just start off with our nose. Mm. 
And I'm out. Put him at our throat. Are you feel it? Now chess. <laughs> <laughs> what about our bellies? <laughs> How was the quality of those laughs? Were they different? Yeah. Yeah, good, very good. Very good, right? Really different, different yeah. energies, yeah. different actions. Yeah. And you now, feel go on, you feel what? You feel, you feel it in each place. Yes. And it made you, made you more happy. Yes, right? Yeah. yeah, that was good. That was good. I never did that before. Me either. Um, <laughs> like good. I said, you're always my guinea pigs every time we meet. <laughs> <laughs> this time the elevator is starting at our toes and this is gradient this is power so we're grounding to the earth and there's these little can you feel your feet on the ground mm -hmm. do you feel strong and supported you're in the place you need to be where you're at right this moment and the giggles are starting to come into the wiggles of the toes. <laughs> and, it's work, and as it works its way up, it gathers power until it comes right out our mouths. Really, you can increase vocal, you can increase power, you can do whatever you feel like as you see it increasing. <laughs> 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 and it's really up here in the top of our heads. <laughs> in the top of our heads. And it's percolating around. <laughs> in your brain and in your scalp. <laughs> gentle refresher so slightly crouch gentle knees relax breathe in hold it you don't need to be bend back this one just hold it and gently release your hands as you breathe out slowly again gathering all that love and laughter and Bathing yourself gently. <sighs> and this time we're going to giggle it out. <laughs> <laughs> Take your finger and we're going to bite on our fingers. So I've shared this many times, but if you put a tongue, a tongue, <laughs> well, you've got a tongue. If you put a pen between your teeth and you hold it, your brain thinks you're smiling. And after a while, it starts to produce endorphins. Oh, wow. So you've tricked your body into 
thinking, it's actually smiling and happy. So that's why sometimes, as you know, in laughter, it's sort of a fake it till you make it. And it's not faking it. You're choosing to laugh and that does make you laugh. So this time we're going to use our fingers and we're going to giggle gently. Make sure you breathe in plenty and breathe out plenty. But just giggle gently. <laughs> and where are you feeling the laughter in your body? Oh, 
<laughs> I love my throat. Ah, I, I love, love my throat. throat. Thank you, throat. Thank you, throat. Thank you, throat. Yes. Voice, right? I love yes. my heart. I love my heart. Thank you, heart. Thank you, heart. I love my belly. I love my belly. Thank you, belly. Yay. Belly. 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 I love my bum. I love my bum. I love my bum. Thank you, bum. I love my thighs. Oh, those big jeans. I love, I love, love my thighs. I love my thighs. I love my thighs. And my legs. I love my legs. I yes, I love my lace. Love my lace. lace. <laughs> I love you, lace. Beautiful lace. <laughs> yes, I love my Imagine lace. Wonderful lace. <laughs> I love you, body. I love your feet. Uh, and thank yourself so in your mind. And I want you to think of something that you maybe don't like about your body so much or you struggle with, or you complain about, you don't need to say it out loud. Just sit with it for a moment and thank it because it is what makes you uniquely you. Full body beauty, being beautifully in our bodies. Thank you. Just say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All of it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Pat yourself. Relax your arms down to the side again. Take a take a deep breath. And if you feel comfortable, close your eyes. And I invite you to think back to a really happy memory that made you laugh. And laugh if you feel like laughing. <laughs> Stroke your arms. If you're under stress and you do just this, it can be very soothing. It's a hug and it's a stroke. Just run your hands down your arms. Release the stress. Feel the comfort. Feel the joy. Remember that beautiful, golden, lovely, bubbly liquid inside that's full of love and laughter and self-acceptance. Slowly open your eyes when you're ready. And if you're able, stand up, please. Now, we sing this song quite a bit in laughter clubs. That's every little cell is happy and healthy. You may know this quite well. But this time, after being in touch, really in touch with our bodies, really sing it, not to make yourself believe it, but sing it as you know those beautiful golden cells and energy within you is bouncing about. And just feel free to move as you like to move that expresses gratitude. Body is happy, everything is well. Body is well. Every little cell in my body is happy. Every little cell in my body is well. 
I'm so happy, happy little self. Every my body's happy and well. I'm so glad, every little self. In my body's happy and well. Little self, little body is happy. Every little self in the body is happy. Little self, little body is happy. Little self, little body is well. I'm so glad. So I'll make all of this available afterwards so that you can use that if you ever want to. And so now, as we're going to draw to a close and before we do that I'm going to ask you at this point to maybe share a little maybe we'll check back in if you feel comfortable just I invite you to again close your eyes and check back in with your body how does it feel were there any changes do you have different words after the practice what did you gain from today's practice? And what will you do differently from here on out to honor and celebrate your body? Wriggle your fingers and your toes gently and slowly open your eyes. Open your eyes. Yes, please. And if you feel comfortable to share, please share with us if anything shifted or changed or what did you get? Did your words change? Anything you'd like to do differently regarding this beautiful vehicle? Yeah, Dusty. <laughs> Thank you so much. Uh, yeah, it's, it's look at my background. It's a celebration to celebrate my body, to celebrate mm. my thighs, to celebrate my backside. Thank you so much. It's so meaningful, especially the ho ho ha ha in different parts of our body. It's so effective, so different from our normal uh, concentrating on the words. But now we are concentrating on different parts of our body, and I felt mm. so happy, and I'm still feeling so happy. Thank you, Dusty. Thank you. Mm. You're welcome. <laughs> I, that's wonderful. <laughs> that's exactly actually how I felt too. Um, that's why I wanted to do this today. Because sometimes I use laughter, and rightfully so, to get away from body pains or problems or things that are going on. I've had chronic illness with ulcers for about a year now. And, um, you know, so I try and celebrate where I can each little gain or victory. But I really wanted to push through and get it more as a practice. And a lot of it is, is when I do mindfulness breathing, actually, it really helps the ulcers. And it helps so many other things. And I know it's stressful at the moment. I'm clenching my jaw because I'm having this big change in my life. And I guess subconsciously, I'm maybe a bit stressful. And this has put me back in my body. And also the laughter, I just thought we disengage from our body sometimes in laughter. We come back, we feel really good physically afterwards and in every other way. But I just thought it'd be nice to try and really thank our bodies and make it a vehicle so we can honestly sing that song too. So thank you, Lee Jean, for sharing that. That was really good. Anyone else? Thank you, Dusty, for lovely moments. I am feeling very light. Uh, light. It, it was wonderful, a full session. Very nice. Thanks. Fantastic. Sir. Thank you. Thank you for contributing and being here. Thank you. <laughs> Mm. Um, yes melissa yes so this physical sensation chart this is uh different and more expansive than anything i've been focusing a lot in my life but i really appreciate this and so i plan to use this in my life 
And I know after when you were doing uh, some of the breathing and shaking, I felt more peaceful. Yeah. So uh, yeah. thank you. This was wonderful. Very great. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm so glad. Uh, yeah, that's why I put, um, maybe we need it even more because we're laughter specialists and therapists and whatever we, you know, <laughs> whatever, advocators or facilitators, right? Maybe we need it more to mm. have the full picture too, or a bigger, broader. And now the people we work with or serve are very varied and they come with different needs. I quite often would work with people at end of life or are hospitalized, so they feel their bodies have betrayed them. Mm -hmm. and they become a disease rather than this beautiful vehicle and even a person their personality and they have a lot of loss so if we can put back and but if you see on this list the well-being and the open is very small compared to all the other states right yeah but aren't they more powerful yeah to yeah. me, they're more powerful. Once yeah. you really incorporate any one of those, you go, oh, Lee Jean, are you, you, you're shaking your hand there. Uh, because I'm seeing Do Doreen's background with all the Malaysians there. <laughs> ah, yeah, I know you've got your, you've got your gang. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry for interruption. Sorry. <laughs> Hi, I have to leave. So I want to tell you, uh, like you said, clearing the cobwebs, that, that was a nice phrase. Mm, yeah. it felt clearing the cobwebs yeah. and, and the other thing was um I do listen to my body but loving my body and thanking my body I thought was mm. important for me to really appreciate because you know I have plants in my house and I talk to my plants and they all have names and <laughs> they like thrive yes I, I just I love them I even touch them I have trees outside my yard that I named they're in front of my windows and I touch them whenever I go outside and appreciate them. And I realize that I don't do that to my body. Mm. Appreciate it by doing, you know, like maybe I'll get exercise, but maybe I don't focus on my sleep or, you know, like appreciating all it does. And another thing I found helped me a lot was opening my eyes and watching everyone else. And your happiness affected me and made me want to laugh more and be more because if I just close my eyes, I'm only in a little bit my world. But when I opened my eyes and I saw the looks on everyone, it it really had a good effect on me. So mm -hmm. I wanted to say thank you to everyone and to you, Susan, of course, Dusty, and just for um, making this special for me. So I have to leave because I, I have somewhere I have to go. But thank you, everybody. Thank you so much. And it's so great to laugh with you again. We'll see yeah. you next time. <laughs> yes, yes. Please let me know. I will. I will. I love you. Happy, well, happy love night. You. Happy sleep and happy bodies, everybody. God Yay, bless. Yay. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye. Any, anyone else? Yes. yes. Maya. Um, yeah, so this was perfect for me. And I'm sorry it was late. Our son just flew to New York and he called us. So, um, but the last two days I've had all this testing done, all these metrics like a bone scan and, and uh, body composition and blood pressure and height and all of that. So I, my mind is all filled with all these numbers that aren't that great. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. This, this was perfect. This has helped me let it all go. And one of the things I wanted to contribute was that recently in one of the uh, thought leaders that I follow, he said, we sometimes have trouble with affirmations, like saying, I am healthy, because what if you don't feel healthy? Mm -hmm. yes. but a way to get around that is to say, may I have a healthy body? Yes. And what the body hears is, I have a healthy body, but yes. you're saying, may I have a healthy yes. body? So you're, mm. you're not- That's um, perfect. You're not um, stating it like your body, you can accept it. And the body just hears, I have a healthy body. And you say, yeah. may I love my body? Well, may I? Yeah, I can give it a try. But my body hears, I love my body. And so I've been yeah. practicing that everywhere. Like whenever I think of something, I'll go like, may I, may I, you know, may my, may I have a healthy knee right now? You know, may my knee not hurt so much or, or whatever, yeah. right? So yeah. whatever you're trying to change. So uh, that's yeah. perfect that's and wonderful for all those metrics i'm trying to do the opposite and say, may I? <laughs> yeah. 
Right. Right. So, Fantastic. Yeah. I commit because I didn't know I was. I had to go into Vancouver and I didn't know if I was meeting with somebody. And so, uh, yeah. Anyway, I'm glad I got. Thank you. That's great. <laughs> <laughs> well, Anyone I else? Friend, I have a friend who I used to laugh with in Ontario. She's in Germany right now, and she's also moving to Belize. Oh, I don't know where about in Belize, but she's going there in September. So I want to find out where exactly you're yes. going. Yes. Yeah, message wow. me and I'll see if I can connect you to. Fantastic. <laughs> That'd be wonderful. Wow. Wow. Next time I'll be showing you Belize. Oh, Exciting. Woo. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, lucky you had your hand up. Yeah, I feel that too. I feel great. Um, I feel um, uh, relieved. I feel relaxed. Um, I would like to thank you, everyone, and especially you, Dusty. Um, your section is very, um, I mean, it's relaxation, especially when you uh, allow us to have a space for ourselves uh, by breathing and mindfulness. And also, I like um, the vibration uh, mm -hmm. around my ears, mm -hmm. uh, my voice. And mm -hmm. my belly, you know, it's mm -hmm. quite fun, but it's really have something like when when I look back, when you ask about the happiness, I look back when I was really young. Mm -hmm. I memorize about when I was playing and play golf. I was mm -hmm. memorizing about um, how I was, how I used to be happy. You know, sometimes when I grow up, I feel happy is quite hard for us sometimes. But when I look back and then, yeah, um, yeah it's brought me to the memories yeah. that I was very happy. Love, very easy. It was very simple. So yeah, very carefree, that. right, as a child? Yeah, exactly, exactly. Yes. Yeah, so thank you so much, everyone, oh, Yeah, for your positive yeah. energy. And this Bangkok in Thailand is early morning, so it, yeah, wake me up. And, yeah, good yeah, start, start to the day. My day. Yeah, it's a, <laughs> such a good day. Thank you. Fantastic. Love you, Han. Marina. Hi. Thank you, Dusty. This this was really uh, great for me to to know another way to to put laughter in in the body. You know, sometimes we focus only on the breathing and doing the laughter exercises. But this is really great and i'm going to tell you this for 11 years my mom was incapacitated so i had a hectic life because i had teenagers at home a business to run and in some point i came disconnected from my body i yeah. came uh, to be numb so yeah. i couldn't realize when i hurt myself or what was uh, what pain did i have so until my body just scream, I, I notice it. So uh, from that day, um, uh, a therapist told me, you have to reach to your body. And one of the ways she told me it was, every time you take a bath, every time you shower, you're going to um, take the soap and you're going to wash each part of your body and you're going to say, this is my hand. I love my mm -hmm. hands. I wow. feel my hands, I feel my, my arms, I feel my legs. I love my body. This is my body. I'm feeling my body. So uh, uh, in, in that time, you are talking to your body. And, and in that way, I came about to connect, reconnect with my body. Because mm -hmm. sometimes you forget about yourself. You forget you have this body. And uh, really, I used to cut myself and then I saw yeah. my my hand bleeding i said what happened when did this happen because you are so disconnected yes. that you you forget you are about you have a body yes you know? and yes. the only way we can feel all these uh, sensations emotions feelings is because we have this body yes we have, we have it's our vehicle body. right yes. it's our yes. it's, and, our, it's and, our earth suit without it we're yes. not yes and and if we don't do that we are not really living the life we should be living. We, yeah. We're not manifesting what we should do uh, with uh, emotions and love and, and why not? All the range of emotions, you know? And that is That's great true. because I never thought about laughter uh, um, making, my, uh, making me conscious of my body while I laugh. 
And yeah. this is great. And, and I don't know if somebody has a use for that exercise. It's really good because you start feeling every part of your body. I'm washing my ears. I feel mm, it's fantastic because my, yeah. I, I'm hearing with my ears, you know? Yes. That's yeah. a way to connect to do that. And, and you're so right. And when we do talk to our bodies, it's usually negative. Yeah. And or how we take care of our bodies can be eating too much starch and sugars and whatever. Yes. And we don't even know it, but it makes us feel better or it calms us instead of going. And that's not bad you can eat certain foods to really calm you and that do help you or energize you yeah but we, maybe we don't do it mindfully when we're disconnected so getting back and what is my body trying to tell me yes what is my body trying to tell me and not just looking for the bad things yes so-called bad things because they're not bad things they're actually mm -hmm. usually signposts that want to help us or to heal or grow or expand mm -hmm. or get rid of stuff even yes. Mm -hmm. yes. so i like that a simple shower is such a powerful place to do this yeah to do that and maybe you you like to eat something but you see uh, instead of uh, reaching to your real emotion and yeah. it's going for example you you crave for sugar but it's only yeah. going to 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 ease yourself for a moment correct and also then, the chewing the yeah. chewing motion yeah. is you're activating your vagal nerve and then also eating food is putting a weight in your stomach so if you're anxious it kind of gives you this weighted blanket feel yeah. but it doesn't last because you're not getting to the root so that chewing that you're not even thinking people just do it when they're stress stress eating so if you actually stopped and did some relaxation or looked at the stress, what's the anxiety trying to show me? Why do I feel that way? And if you explore it, you chances are you'll probably forget that you wanted to have another piece of cake or something. Yeah, or, or you're craving for something and you're anxious. And if you don't stop and say, okay, why I'm so anxious? Oh, because I have to do this and that. Well, better sit down and breathe and maybe drink water and say, okay, I'm going to give you my time and I'm going to do at my pace. I don't Correct. Have Wonderful. Yeah. Um, cold water is very helpful for that. Yeah. I don't usually drink cold water, but a very cold, if you're under stress, anxiety, and you start sipping on very, very cold water, it kind of, because it has such an impact, it does start to come you and you have to concentrate on it and it just makes you breathe and slow a bit. Um, yeah. if anyone else before we go and I have one little song that I'll play at the end. Marcia, do you have anything? No pressure, you don't have to if you don't. <laughs> well, I, I missed about 20 minutes because my computer crashed on me. Oh, I, no. I couldn't get it to run at all. And uh, it revived itself, thank goodness. I don't know what happened to it, but so I missed a lot. So I'm learning oh. a lot at the very end with everybody talking about things that happened when I didn't get to see it. Okay. So I've enjoyed it and I've learned a lot and I really liked it. It's great. Fantastic. Well, thank you for being here. And what I'll do is I'll put the video up so you'll be able to see it. And I'll put the materials. And then if, um, yeah, if you, I'll put them up as slides so you can use them, you know, if you ever want to. And uh, I'll put links to the music. So it's all here. So what I'd like to end with is, Thank you. We are not alone in our pains or gains. I always end with this. May we know how deeply loved and valued we are at our core being, and may we help others understand these truths too. And as you know, I always do, and we do it together, as I am one with you, you are one with me, we are one, you see, it's the ho, ho, ha, ha, ha chant rhythm. But this time, I invite you to do it to your body as from your emotions, your mental and your spiritual is incorporating your body. So I am one with you. You are I'm one, one with, with me. me. We are, are one with you. So we've come back home. This is our home. Wherever we go in this world, this is our home. And I want to end with this. This is the happy song. And 
White Eagle has added an extra verse. And I just thought it was so inspiring. It was so fun that I thought I'd play it for you. If I can find, let's see. I'm guessing it's about here. Let's see if I've got it. So. Dusty, there's no sound. Oh, really? <laughs> and anyone else here? Hang on. You're not sharing the sound. You're sharing. Oh, oh, yeah, the share, the share screen. You need to share sound. I think. <laughs> I do, but it should be because it did on the first one. Audio mm -hmm. settings. Yeah. Huh. Okay. It says you're sharing screen. Yeah, only yeah. the screen. Then you yeah. click the sound. The sound. Mm. So where did I delete the sound? Where do I turn it on? It's uh, not bottom, on. Me. Bottom left. Of? Of the microphone. Of your share screen. Of your share okay, screen. I'm going to stop the, um, let's see. On my share screen. Okay, I'm going to stop recording. <laughs> 